Hi, welcome folks. I'm Mark Mahaffey. Today we're shooting a plein air video in the greater Cincinnati area. I'm going to create some atmospheric perspective this afternoon where there virtually isn't any. Uh, we're shooting mid-afternoon, early afternoon. The low light of the morning is gone. The low light of the afternoon is not here yet. So we're going to try to make a good painting out of a scene that if you recorded it exactly as you see it probably would not make the most exciting painting. My goal in plain air is to make a good painting, not to record exactly what I see. Um, follow along with us. We're going to have fun. Let's get started. We'll block in this tree. Closer in space than this distant background, closer than even these, so I'm a little bit warmer. I'm slightly lighter. Keep it simple. Big shapes. As soon as I say big shapes, of course, I add a little shape right there. And I don't know if you saw that, but I had paint building up on the, on the edge of my brush. There's a lot of pigment building up in the heel of this brush. And so I'm painting with the tip of the brush, but if I need a little extra paint, I can do this and just lay extra paint down and then blend it in. Tricky, huh? We're top lit today because during the middle of the day, the sun is right above us. Let's address this large expanse of grass. So again, I'm keeping things fairly neutral here with my final focal area in mind. So I'm using both CAD red medium dark, excuse me, and CAD yellow light, and we'll test the value, pretty good. It's a pretty static edge as we go across there. Let's make a little bit of a temperature change and we'll get a little lighter. That creates a little more interest. So we're, we're heightening and warming the grass in this immediate vicinity. Our focal area is going to be here, right in this area. Notice that I've made a temperature change and a slightly lighter value change right here. And as we go away from that, I'm going to go back and get a little darker. It's time now to deal with the uh, focal area. So I'm going to switch brushes and go to my small brush. Um, and this is the star of the show right here. But we have some supporting cast of characters. I'm going to go to my CAD Yellow Dark, which is probably a little too saturated or intense. Uh, let's just add a couple and see. Nope, pretty good. So this is supporting cast. This is CAD yellow dark, right as it comes from the tube, which seems to be subdued enough. Not too many, not too many, because I want more here.
Now we're going to add some light. So I've gone to my CAD yellow light and I'm mixing that with my CAD yellow dark. This is focal area again, remember. 